Let's now shift focus to China. It appears to be rehearsing for war with the U.S. Damning new satellite images showing China bombing models of American fighter jets as part of a rehearsal of a military assault. The satellite images taken over a remote desert area in northwest China show massive scorch marks next to low-tech models of what look like F-35s and F-22s. These are some of the most advanced jets used by the U.S. Army. The question is, is China rehearsing, shooting them down? It sure looks like it. The Chinese military has built these models of American fighter jets apparently to use as target practice. That's not all. The photos show a long runway with several scorch marks at the top end. It's not clear what weapons were used to leave such a mark. But as per the British newspaper, The Times, it looks like precision missiles were used. The location is also important. The drills took place in Taklamakan Desert. Located in Xinjiang province, this province, as we know by now, is already home to China's military testing. Around three years ago, it was revealed that China had built up models of an American Ford-class aircraft carrier for similar purposes. What is all this in preparation of, is the question. Is China preparing to go to war? We know that there has been comprehensive overhaul of the Chinese military ever since President Xi Jinping came to power. The People's Liberation Army has, uh, was already the largest in the world. But since Xi Jinping came to power in 2012, China now has a navy that has surpassed the United States in terms of crude number of ships. It is also expected to be 50% larger by 2035. Sure, the US still has the largest fleet with 11 aircraft carrier groups and has a global reach beyond China's capacity. China is starting to catch up though. And what's more, China is also believed to be planning a third sea trial later this week for its first domestically built aircraft carrier, the Fujian. As far as air forces is concerned, China is still thought to be lagging behind America, both in numbers and also in advanced avionic equipment. Which brings us back to satellite images. The main purpose of the new drills seems to be to test improvements in missile technology, an area that China has reportedly neglected over the years. Why is that, you ask? It's because the section within the Chinese military responsible for missile technology, known as the rocket force, has been at the heart of, a, of corruption allegations. But Xi Jinping has recently cracked down on corruption within the PLA ranks by ordering investigation and purge. No one should be surprised if China has started testing its missiles once again. It also comes at a time when China looks ready to invade Taiwan. Beijing has, on numerous occasions, declared its intent to reunite Taiwan with the mainland. In doing so, Beijing has never renounced the use of force to bring Taiwan under its control. In fact, on Tuesday, a Chinese military drone was seen hovering near an airport on a remote island in Taiwan. The drone was spotted around five nautical miles from Matsu's Nangan airport. And it stayed there, by the way, for about 20 minutes. Taipei's military and local media are saying that caused delays to flights in Taiwan. The possibility of China invading Taiwan has created tensions between the US and China. Of course, who can forget how former US House Representative Nancy Pelosi's visit to Taiwan in 2022 triggered a fiery response from China. A quick recap. Pelosi visited Taiwan in defiance of Chinese warnings for the trip to not take place. China launched war games near the island to show its protest and anger. China's military fired missiles over Taipei, flew waves of drones over some of Taiwan's islands, sailed warships across the median line of the Taiwan Strait, and surrounded the island in what Taiwan's military said amounted to a practice blockade. Target practice on fake American jets confirming what analysts have been saying for a long time.
China is definitely preparing for war. They say that the use of the mock airbase is in line with the analysis that China's main military focus is on how to constrain the U.S. in any conflict over Taiwan. As per a new study by an American think tank called the Center for Strategic and International Studies, China is helping Cuba build new interception stations. And why is that? To monitor U.S. bases, including Guantanamo Bay. The island is close to Florida, which is home to important U.S. military facilities, as well as the main U.S. space launch facilities at Cape Canaveral and the Kennedy Space Center. And due to all these reasons and more, saying that China is preparing for war with America is certainly not an exaggeration. To stay up to speed with the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.